adore you just wanna tell you lord i love you more than anything help me sing it come on sing help me sing i love you jesus i worship and adore you just want to tell you lord i love you more than anything i love you jesus i worship and adore you just want to tell you I just got to tell you that I love you. Oh, I love you. I love you. I love you, Jesus. And I worship and I worship and adore you. I've come today to tell you. Oh, 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 Rabbanai oko tetaraba ye kete de bebe ya koto rababasi i ananaba ko shoto rababasi Lord I love you more than anything Hallelujah Come on give the Lord a hand of praise Come on put your hands together for the Lord Thank you Jesus Hallelujah. We bless the Lord for the way he has moved today and where he's moving now. We just want to honor the Spirit of God and we're just going to welcome our speaker for this morning. She is a mighty woman of God. She is a prayer warrior extraordinaire and she is an evangelist of evangelists. Amen. So this morning, we just want to put our hands together and we want to honor our evangelist, Jillian Williams. Put your hands together for her as she comes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah to the King of Kings today. And the Lord of Lords. He is the conquering lion of the tribe of Judah. The one who breaks chains. Hallelujah. The one who woke us up this morning. Our clock didn't. We are still in our right mind. We are walking above our grave, and our blood is still running warm in our veins. Give him praise and glory in this place. Give him praise and glory in this place. Give him praise and glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I must give honor to the Spirit of God who is the head of my life. Hallelujah, the one that I love, the one that I adore, and the one that I praise. And all my hallelujah belongs to him because he deserves it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I must also give honor to my pastor, Pastor Verona Burton. Oh, hallelujah to your name, Jesus. Glory to your name. Glory to your name. Glory to your name. Glory to your name. Hallelujah. Thank God for her. 
praise God, a woman of God and somebody that knows me. Praise the name of the Lord. She knows me and I give God thanks for her. Somebody that tolerate me and I give thanks, God thanks for her. Praise God, someone that bears me up in prayer and I give God thanks for you, Pastor Burton. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I must also give honor to Pastor McKee, Matthew McKee, in his absent. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. I must also give honor to, hallelujah, Jesus, Minister Marks. Hallelujah. Minister Foy. Praise the name of the Lord. Missionary Thomas. Hallelujah. Minister Twait. Twait. Sorry about that. Hallelujah. Evangelist Lawrence. Oh, hallelujah. Elder, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Calendar. And all God's children accept greetings. I must also, hallelujah, say welcome to those, to the couple. Hallelujah. Welcome back. Amen. I see that you're shining. Glad to have you. Amen. Glory to God. Surely the blessing of the Lord make it rich. And it had no sorrow with it. And truly God is blessing holy love. Praise God and I give him praise for that today. Glory to God. Glory to God. It's my turn today to bring forth the word of God. And I ask you to pray me up. Praise the name of the Lord. And as the scripture, hallelujah, Jesus was read earlier. Praise God, St. John 19. Glory to God this morning for his goodness and for his mercy. Praise God, I depend on him for his strength and also for his leading. And you know, today, as the series goes on, hallelujah, the topic is the cross. And the subtopic that I have today is God, God's rescue mission oh hallelujah hallelujah i said god's rescue mission praise the name of the lord our god glory to your name jesus glory to your name jesus glory to god in the highest praise god god rescue mission praise god as you know he rescued us praise god as the right to say rescue the perishing care for the dying glory to god and today we can attest to that that he rescued us praise god hallelujah we were destined for hell but jesus came along our way and he rescued us and today we are rejoicing in this free and full salvation hallelujah it is all because of the cross that old rugged cross Glory to God, an emblem, oh, praise the name of, of suffering and shame. Hallelujah. And I will cling to that old rugged cross and exchange it someday for a crown. Praise God, as the scripture already read. Oh, praise God, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise God, I must say, praise God in the name of Jesus in St. John 19. Amen. He spoke of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, God. When Oh, hallelujah, was taken to Golgotha's hill, and he was crucified. Hallelujah. Praise God, almighty God. And praise God, alongside him was two thieves, one on the left and one on the right. Oh, praise God in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. He was mocked. He was scorned. He was deride. Praise God. But he didn't come down. He stood upon that old rugged cross. Glory to God. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. And as we were. This, we, there's a universe. And in the universe there's a solar system. And within that system there are nine planets. Praise God. And one of the planets. Oh hallelujah. It is said that. Hallelujah, that planet, we live on earth. Praise the name of the Lord. And in only earth, hallelujah, you will find habitation. Though men may try, and they are trying, 
and they are searching other planets to see if there is life there. But God, to our knowledge, only earth was designed to have life. Oh, praise the name of the Lord our God. Give him praise and glory in this place. Give him praise and glory in this place. Oh, hallelujah. The Bible declares that God spoke in existence. Oh, praise God. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah, Jesus. And he said, let there be light and there was light. He spoke and it was done. He commanded and he stood fast. But God took the time out. Hallelujah to make somebody. Oh God in his own image. Hallelujah in his own likeness. And he took the time out. And he formed him. Hallelujah. And after he was formed, man was laid there lifeless. Oh, praise God, man couldn't move. Man couldn't hear. Man couldn't walk. Man couldn't handle. But God stooped down and he blew the bread of man. And man became a living soul. The Bible also declares that he made man a little lower than the angels. And today we are a living soul because of what he has placed in us. And this morning we are here to rejoice of the good, hallelujah, hallelujah, salvation that Jesus Christ brought unto man. Oh, praise the name of the Lord. And God made a garden. And God said, man, I want you to be, hallelujah, hallelujah, to be the gardener for this place. I want you to keep it. I want you to attend to it. I want everything to go in order. But there is one thing I don't want you to do. There is a tree in the midst of that garden. And I want, hallelujah, for you to eat everything. Except for that one tree. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Hallelujah. 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 For the day you touch it, you shall surely die. Something. You're going to experience something that you have never experienced before. If you touch that tree, man went ahead. Oh, hallelujah. And man touched and disobeyed God. Oh, hallelujah. And the bond between man and God was broken. Spiritually severed. Hallelujah. 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 And the retribution for that was very harsh. God said, I gave you a place of comfort. I gave you a place that you will lack nothing. Glory to God. I gave you a place that you eat everything. I gave you a place that even the rain was falling. It was the dew from heaven. But because you go, you disobeyed me. You messed up my plan. Hallelujah. And you're going to know what hardship is like. I want you to pack up your things. And I want you to get out. You don't, man, you don't know what is good. I want you to get out. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And man, hallelujah, died spiritually. There wasn't any connection between man and his God. Spiritually. Man couldn't feel his God anymore. Man couldn't communicate with God anymore. Because there was a gap between man and God. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. There was a gulf between man and God. Man could not look on sin anymore. Oh, glory to God. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Man found himself naked. Man was clothed in righteousness. But man found himself having a tattered clothes. Man began to make leave to cover himself. After he was clothed with the glory of God. He was stripped. 
Oh, hallelujah. Like on hurt here today. When somebody has a tiger and they have done something wrong, they strip them. Hallelujah. Of their rank. They strip them of their tiger because they messed up. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. But we serve a mighty God today. We serve a God that is not like man who hold grudges, who hold us to our fault. Glory to God, that the God in whom we served. But God looked, hallelujah, man. And hallelujah, saw that man need help. Oh, hallelujah. And man, God, Hallelujah. Said I have to reclaim man. I have to reclaim man. The person that was made in my, my own image. Ha 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 ha. In my own image. In my own likeness. I gave him life. I gave him a part of me. Without a part of me. He could not move. It's after I gave him a part of me. He started walking. He started talking. I need that communication. I need it back with him. I have to do something. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And Revelation spoke. Oh, hallelujah. That John was in the Isle of Patmos. Oh, glory to God. And John saw a book. Glory to God. An assembly was called in heaven. An assembly was called in heaven. And the word, uh, the question was asked, who, who will go? Who will go to redeem man? Hallelujah back to God. Amen. When John in the Isle of Patmos, hallelujah, said, no one in heaven, no one on earth, no one on the earth could have redeemed man, could have brought that man to God. Oh, hallelujah. And John began to weep. Hallelujah. Because there was no hope. Oh, no hope for man. Glory to God. And when John looked uh, and he saw a lamb, a lamb that was slain, uh, glory to God, glory to God. And he saw when the lamb went, how uh, oh God, and he wore the book uh, and he broke the seal uh, and he broke the bond and he was unworthy. He was unworthy. He was unworthy. Only him that could break the seal. That could loose, hallelujah, the bond and open the book. Only the lamb, the lamb was slain. Glory to God, the spotless lamb of God. Glory to God, glory to God, glory to God. And John said, Behold the Lamb of God. Oh, hallelujah. He is the Lion of the tribe of Judah. Who has prevailed to open the book and to break the seal. And I hear, oh, glory to God, Isaiah 9 says, Nevertheless, the dimness shall not be such has in our vexation when at last him and he lighted afflicted the land of Zebulun the people I said the people that sat in darkness have seen a great light glory to God glory to God there wasn't hope there was no hope until that seal was broken glory to God and the people that that there was sitting in darkness have seen have seen the light I hear the writer said I have seen the light shining so bright shining so bright hallelujah glory to God 
glory to God. And because uh, they found somebody, God said yes. 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 Glory to God. Isaiah himself proclaimed, for unto us a child is born. Unto us a son is given. And Elobosata. And his name shall be called Wonderful. He's a counselor. He's a mighty God. The everlasting Father. The great Prince of Peace. Glory to God. And of his kingdom. And of his government. There is no end. Hallelujah. He's from everlasting to everlasting. Glory to God. The creature of the universe. Hallelujah. The creator of the universe chose to define, confine himself to a vulnerable state of a body, live as a human. Hallelujah. To experience what we experience. Hallelujah. And to be ultimately died at the hand of human so that we can experience a relationship with God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. You know the reason why? For the blood of beasts could not, could not atone for man's sin. The blood of beasts could not atone. Not all the blood of beasts and Jewish altar slayed could wash the guilty conscience free or take away our stain. But Christ, our heavenly lamb, Take all our sins away. Glory to God. Glory to God. Give him glory. Glory. Glory to God. Glory to God. For the Bible declares it. That without the shedding of blood. There will be no pardon for sin. Oh hallelujah. There will be no pardon for sin. We cannot pay our way into heaven. Yeah, Amen. We cannot like taking a bus or taking the airplane. That you have to pay your way. It takes a personal relationship. It takes a hallelujah, hallelujah. A washing of the blood of Jesus Christ. Ah, God to wash away our stain. Oh, glory to God to make us clean. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. So hallelujah. 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 And Jesus Christ came. Because he was the only one. That was found worthy. Hallelujah. To break the seal. Hallelujah. To redeem mankind. Glory to God. And as we know the story well. He came. And he was born of a virgin Mary. Glory, glory to God. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Glory to God. Born of a virgin. Hallelujah. And he has grown. And the time has came. When, hallelujah, he should be. Hallelujah, crucified. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Praise God. In the fullness of time, Jesus Christ came to redeem us from all our sins. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Glory to God. I said without the shedding of blood, there will be no pardon for sin. Oh, praise the name of the Lord. Ah, God and Isaiah saw him coming. And he said he's a spotless lamb of God that takes away the sin of this world. Oh, glory to God in the heavens. Praise God, praise God. And as John wrote, amen, as he go up to Golgotha's hill. Ah, God, with that whole rugged cross. Oh, praise God Almighty. They place him on the cross. He could have called 10,000 angels to destroy the world and to set him free. But he died alone for you and me. Oh, God, it was you and I on his mind. We were on his mind. Oh, hallelujah, we were on his mind. He who's left his glory 
Hallelujah, hallelujah. He who left his glory, he came down in the form of man. And he gave his life for us. The Bible said, greater love had no man than this. Then a man laid down his life. Oh, hallelujah for his friends. And after he was crucified, glory to God before he was crucified. He was taken to the judgment hall. He was taken to Pilate. Hallelujah, hallelujah. They mocked him. Oh, hallelujah. They scorn him. They deride him. Hey, they ridicule him. But it was for us, the guilty sinner. Oh, hallelujah. Stay, he stood in his place. Oh, praise the name of the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. At one point, uh, Pilate said, do you, do, uh, you don't know that I have power, hallelujah, to release you. Jesus Christ declared, you can only have power. And it came from God. Oh, glory to God. But he stood in our, in our place. Oh, glory to God. Just to set a sinner like us free. Oh, praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, God. And God sent someone to rescue us. I hear the writer say, rescue the perishing. Care for all the dying. Snatch in pity. And from sin and the grave. Oh, hallelujah. Lay. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. How God and while he hung there on the cross, two male factors was there. Oh, hallelujah. I said Jesus Christ came to deliver, came to rescue us. And even on the cross, he was rescuing someone. Oh, one, oh, rail on him. The one that humbled himself and said, Father, Hallelujah, hallelujah. When you go into your kingdom, remember me. Oh, hallelujah. Because I am worthy. What I am bearing on the cross, I am guilty. I am guilty, but you are a guiltless man. You have done no wrong. Pilate found no fault in you. But because of the Jews, oh, glory to God. They want to get him out of the way. Because Jesus Christ came with a new time type of doctrine glory to God they were following the laws of Moses but Jesus Christ came with a redemptive message to redeem us from all of our sins so Jesus was boiling up their business Jesus was gaining people and for them amen they said we have to orchestrate a plan we have to stop this man because everybody keep running to Jesus they keep running to Jesus because he came to save mankind from all sins it was not about bullocks and pigeons and turtle doves it was not about the law anymore but it was all about redemption I hear the writer said redemption coming praise the Lord what a wonderful freedom glory to his name I'm out of the bondage I'm into God's freedom ah, redemption when they heard what Jesus was saying they like it and they started to follow him the Jews didn't like it the Jews didn't like it they said we have to stop him from preaching this kind of message but it was for us the guilty sinner glory to God glory to God glory to God glory oh handolobo sata Roba Baba Sanda. Global Baba Sanda. Hinda Baba Saya. I said the dimness. Hallelujah. The people that sat in darkness have seen the light. Those people saw the light. Oh, hallelujah. At one point, John said, Behold the Lamb of God that takes away the sin of this world those people saw the lamb they saw God in him the message what he was preaching was satisfying for their soul oh hallelujah and Jesus came oh hallelujah to rescue us hallelujah but and I remember before he went on Calvary the Bible declares it that Jesus 
must need go through Samaria. Glory to God. He must need go through Samaria because somebody needed needed him in Samaria. Somebody needed him in Sychar. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody needed a refreshing. Somebody needed a new life. A new life. I said a new life. And Jesus said, Hallelujah. Jesus started to get, let me put it in this term, download from heaven. Jesus, somebody, I heard a soul in Sychar that is tired of the life she live. She need a new life. She need a new life. She want to make over. She want to change. So I'm asking you, son, go down to Sychar because I hear a song. Tired of the life she lived, she wanted a change, and I'm sending you down there to Saika. And when you go to Saika, you will meet her on the way. Oh, somebody in Samaria is tired. She tired of taking away the woman's husband. She took away seven men. I heard some crying down in Sychar. Hallelujah. She need a change. She's tired of the life she live. She's tired of the life she live. She's tired of them mocking her. Oh, oh, oh. hallelujah. Hallelujah. She's so tired. Hallelujah. When they saw her coming, you can expect hold on to your man. Hold on. Hold on. Because she's coming. Hold on. Hallelujah. Her reputation is going around and take away people's man. Glory to God. But Jesus said, I'm going to change your woman. I have a better life for you. You don't need to go around taking away man's hallelujah. Who men's men? Who men's husband? I have a, a, a work for you to do. Jesus to the rescue. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. When he came to Samaria, he was tired because I said. He knew that she was coming because uh, the father already tell him that somebody will be coming at the well at 12 noon. So get there and I want you to sit there because she will be coming and I want you to have a, a conversation. So when she came, uh, she and Jesus had a dialogue. Glory to God. Glory to God. Jesus, uh, oh hallelujah, put the question first. Uh, glory to God, give me to drink. He started the conversation. Give me. Because he's on a rescue mission. Give me to drink. The woman said, give you to drink? The Jews have no dealing with the Samaritan. But Jesus was on a mission. Hallelujah! He was on a mission. Somebody needed Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Somebody was tired of the life she lived. She don't want to live that life anymore. I am tired of when women see me coming. Beware. She's coming. I'm tired of that life. I need a new life. I need a satisfaction that this world cannot give me, that men cannot give me. I've tried them all, but it's not working for me. I needed something to satisfy my longing. Glory to God. And Jesus met her there. And I said they started a conversation. Jesus said, Hallelujah. 
Hallelujah, give me to drink. She said, I have nothing to draw with. Nothing. And you're asking me for water. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And after, glory to God, they start conversing. Jesus said, I have something to give to you. That when I give this to you, you need not, hallelujah, thirst anymore. I know you need the natural water. Glory to God. Because you have to drink it. But you have a thirst that only the spiritual man, that only God can quench. You have a thirst that no matter what you have done, when you left Peter, you go to Paul, you go to James, you go to John, you go to Anthony. They cannot satisfy you. But what I'll be giving you today, hallelujah, will be in you. A well of water springing up into eternal life. And I said, the woman said, Dah, Father, give me that water. Give me the water that I come here. Not again. She was not aware of the spiritual water. But when Jesus Christ started to expound the word to her and the change, the Holy Spirit took a whole of her heart and God started to move. The Spirit of God started to move in the woman's heart. She said, Sir, I perceive you're a prophet. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You tell me everything that I have done in the past. But give me that water because I want to drink of it. That I thirst not again. And Jesus, hallelujah, the word of God. The Bible said the word of God, their life and their spirit. And when the woman begin to receive the word, it start to change. It start to change. Turn our life uh, around. Uh, to, uh, amen. The transformation begin to take place. Uh, I'm no longer a slave to fear. I am no longer a slave uh, to sin. Uh, I am now a child of God. I uh, made me run uh, to the city to tell the men uh, that I used to uh, run around with. Uh, but I'm no longer Satisfaction, you come to me. I am a change woman. I am a change woman because I met the man of Galilee who told me all the things that I have done. I'm no longer Jane. I am no longer Jane. I am now an evangelist preaching the word of the living God. So come. He has changed me. He will change you. He will change you. He will change you. He will change you. All you need to do, submit to him. Surrender your heart to him. Glory to God. Glory to God. I said he came to rescue. He changed a woman. And she eventually, instantly, became an evangelist glory to God oh hallelujah I said Jesus Christ to the rescue praise the name of the Lord glory to God hallelujah and we read also in John 4 that spoke, that spoke of the good Samaritan remember the good Samaritan Glory to God. Praise God. 
Hallelujah. I said he came to rescue. Yes. Jesus said to his disciple, I did not come to be ministered to. I came to minister. Glory to God. I came to set the people free from their sins. I came to break the yoke. I came to destroy. Hallelujah. I came to set man free. The Bible tells us, for he came to save his people from all their sins. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. And he spoke of the parable. That a man went down. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And he fell among thieves. And all those came. Some look at him. Some walk their head. Glory to God. Even the religious. But because Jesus came to rescue. Glory to God. He said that good Samaritan, hallelujah, saw him and saw the need. He was wounded. He was bruised and left to die because somebody robbed him. But that good Samaritan, we are like that. Hallelujah. Remember the state that we were in before we came in contact with Jesus Christ? We were messed up. Bruised and battered. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Nobody wants us to be their friend. But Jesus Christ came. Oh, praise God. And the Bible declared that he poured in oil and wine. Oh, glory to God. He poured in oil and wine. Hallelujah to that. Wounded man. Oh, hallelujah. And restore him. Some of us were like that. Bruised batter the life we live satan have us like a ball glory to god but jesus christ came along oh hallelujah and he poured in oil and wine oh praise god and he makes something out of us today look at us we're a brand new creature hallelujah all things are passed away i'm a brand new man glory to god glory to god glory to the most of the, to the high God. Many of us can attest to that. The life we lived before we came to Jesus. It was not good. It was not good. Just like the woman at the well. Just like that Samaritan. But Jesus came to our rescue. And he poured in oil and wine. And now we are rejoicing. Because uh, we have met the man. Uh, the man Christ Jesus. Uh, who have told us. Uh, hallelujah. That I have a better life for you. Because every one of us. Uh, was born for a purpose. Uh, believe it or not. Uh, you came here for a purpose. Uh, Oh, glory to God. And God wants us to fulfill our purpose. Ah, oh, God, and he came. And he knocked on our heart. Ah, oh, God, and we say yes to him. Ah, oh, God, and no, we are no longer a slave to fear. But we are children of the most high God. Oh, I hear John said, Paul said, we are no more bastard. Oh, hallelujah. But we are sons of the most high God. We are hearers and joint tears. Oh, glory to God. Oh, hallelujah. Glory to Jesus Christ for what he has done. When he hung upon the cross, he could have called 10,000 angels to destroy the world and to set him free. But he died alone so that you and I can have this access. We were just dancing. We were just praising in the God of our salvation because we have tasted and see that the Lord is good. And now we are rejoicing in this full and free salvation. Give him praise and glory. Give him praise and glory. Give him praise and glory. Oh, hallelujah. Glory to God. Jesus' courage and persistent certainly won the victory. 
And we are no longer a slave, a slave to fear. No longer. Oh, hallelujah. We are no longer, oh, hallelujah, in bondage. We are children of the Most High God. Oh, hallelujah. No more chains holding us. Oh, praise God, we are free. Oh, glory, 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 glory. Hallelujah, hallelujah. And after he was hanging there on the cross, the time came. Oh, praise God. And he said, it is finished. It is finished. And he gave up the ghost. Glory to God. And I hear First Corinthians said, oh, death, where is your sting? Hallelujah. Oh, grave, where is your victory? Where is it? After he was crucified and he was placed in the grave, the devil thought that he had him. The devil thought that it was, that it, it, it was finished. Oh, glory to God. Glory to God. But Jesus Christ knew. Oh, hallelujah, that the third day is coming. Hallelujah. 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 I said the cross in him we find life. In him we have joy. In him we have peace. In him we have happiness. That cross. But the third day was coming. After they mocked him. After they deride him. Have the despot on him. Oh, they placed a crown of thorn on his head. Amen. They gave him a robe. And they said, Hail, King of the Jews. Oh, hallelujah. But Jesus knew that this was just for a short period. Because Sunday was on its way. I said, Sunday morning was coming. Sunday morning was coming. Sunday was coming. So God gave me the strength to go through Friday, Saturday, because Sunday is on his way. Resurrection morning is on his way. And when the enemy thought, all is well, all is well. I hear the Bible said, the seed of the woman shall crush the head of the serpent. Glory to God. Sunday morning, the enemy head will be crushed. Crush, crush, crush. So when he thought he was bruising Jesus Christ, Sunday morning his head will be trampled. Oh, hallelujah. And when he was in that grave, I could hear under the Messiah, there was a shaking. There was a shaking. There was a shaking. There was a shaking. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The King of Kings uh, is coming forth. Uh, the King of Kings uh, no longer. No longer. No chain. Uh, no chain. Uh, no grave. Could not hold my body down. But hope uh, from the grave. Uh, he arose with a mighty triumph over his soul. He arose. He arose, he arose, the victor from the dark domain, and he lives forever with his saints to reign. He arose. Hallelujah. 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 And he lives within our heart. He lives within our heart. He walk with us uh, and he talk with us uh, a long life far away. And sometimes when the burden is heavy, glory to God, we cast our cares upon him. Oh, hallelujah. Glory to God. He has broken down the walls. Hallelujah. Partition between man and God. And we are no longer a slave. Hallelujah. But we are children of the Most High God. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. I said he came on a rescue mission. Ah, God, and he rescued us from our sins. Oh, hallelujah. 
Glory to God. The writer said, Lo, in the grave he lay. Jesus, our Savior, waiting for the coming day. Jesus Christ, our Lord. But up from the grave he arose. Oh, with a mighty triumph over the enemy. He rose the victor. And we can attest to that today. Oh, hallelujah. That he has risen in our heart. And there's no need for us to worry. That we must cast our cares upon him. Oh, hallelujah. God didn't thought it robbery for him to be equal with God. But he made of himself of no reputation. Ah, God and became obedient. Hallelujah. Unto that cross. So that you and I this morning can be forgiven and ac access to the throne of grace. Give him praise and glory. Give him praise and glory. Give him praise and glory. Glory, glory, glory. Oh, hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. He's our Prince of Peace. He's the Rose of Sharon. He's the Lily of the Valley. He's a bright and morning star. And we are given a name that is above, he was given a name that is above every name. That has his name, every knee shall bow. And every tongue on earth confess. Oh, glory to God that Jesus Christ is Lord. Amen. Let me say to you, brethren, today, it does not matter how tear stain how a path may be. Oh, hallelujah. And we have countless night. We are, uh, hallelujah, we have many reasons to give him praise. To give him praise for what he has done. For what Christ has done. He went to the cross. He bled and he died. I said he stood in our place. He was mocked. Oh, because of Jesus Christ. Oh, Pilate. Hallelujah, hallelujah. And, and Herod became friend. Oh, there were enemies. Jesus Christ to the rescue. Praise the name of the Lord. He came to rescue us. The writer said, rescue the perishing. Care for the dying. Snatch us in pity. And from the grave. Uh, glory to God. When Mary Magdalene went there. Amen. The angel said, he is not here. But he is risen. Oh, hallelujah. 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 He is risen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He is risen up from the grave. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He is risen King of Kings. He is risen Lord of Lords. He rose in that human heart. And today he has done the same thing for us. We are no longer a slave. Oh, hallelujah to sin. But we are now children of the most high God. Oh, hallelujah. And whenever we have our problems, we can cast our cares. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Now God can see us through Jesus Christ. Oh, hallelujah, the Lamb of God who takes away the one that was found worthy to break the seal. The only one that was found worthy to open the book. Glory to God. Glory to God. Thank God for that cross on a hill far away. Stood an old rugged cross. Oh, the emblem of sin, of suffering and shame. Oh, and I love that our cross. Oh, we are the dearest and blessed. For a world of lost sinners. Was, so I cherish that whole rugged cross. Oh, hallelujah. In the cross be my glory ever. It is because of the cross. Jesus hung there. He was given, hallelujah. Hallelujah, vinegar, mingle with God. He took it because he saw that one day you and I, Alabosata Rabababa, needed a savior. 
Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. He needed. He knew that we would accept him. And we will, we would be encountered. Many things along life journey. Many ups and many down. Oh God, we would experience a time of weeping. A time of mourning. A time of dancing. A time of singing. He knew that during our mourning we needed someone to comfort us. Oh hallelujah. And he stood on the cross. Oh bless the name of the Lord. That when the time comes. When the enemy comes up like a flood, rob us and all of us. The Spirit of God will lift up a standard against him. When we need a strength and think we cannot go on any longer, oh, he will pour out of his Spirit upon all flesh. Oh, hallelujah. When we think that the burden is too heavy to bear, oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. He will lighten our load because he said, my yoke is easy and my burden is light. When we think that there is no hope, we say like David, I will look unto the hills. From whence cometh my help? From my help cometh from the Lord who made heaven and earth. Oh, glory to God. And I will look oh, who is a present help in time of my trouble. When and troubles on my left uh, and troubles on the right uh, and all around me my soul give way he will be my hope uh, and my say hallelujah for on Christ uh, the solid rock I will stand uh, everything else uh, will be sinking sun uh, oh glory to God because uh, what he has done for me he stood on the cross and he won the battle and the enemy has no power over me. Has no power over me. Ah, I have the victory. Oh, to Jesus. Oh, I hear the right to the victory is mine. Victory today is mine. I told Satan, God be behind Satan for victory. Today is mine. Oh God. Jesus Christ did it for us. Oh glory to God. And today we can rejoice in this full and free salvation. Because of what he has done for us on the cross. In the cross be my glory ever. Till my rapture so shall find. Rest beyond the river. Oh glory to God. I hear the songwriter said. I know a man who can. I know a man who can. I know a man who can. So whatever you're going through today, Jesus can. It seems hard. Yes. Life is like a mountain railroad. Glory to God. Life is like a mountain railroad. Oh, hallelujah for those people who have traveled in a plane. Glory to God at times. Oh God, the ride is so smooth. And at time, amen, we hear the pilot said, put on your seatbelt. Oh, hallelujah, embrace. Because we'll be going through some turbulences. Life is like that sometimes. There are turbulences along life way. Glory to God. But there is hope in King Jesus. There is hope in the Lord. The writer said, my hope is built and nothing less than Jesus' blood and his righteousness. I dare not trust the sweetest frame, but only lean on Jesus' name. For on Christ, I said on Christ, on Christ, the solid rock I stand. Everything else is sinking, shine. When Jesus is in your ship, amen. Amen, you will get over the billows. You will get over the waves. As he told the disciple, we are going over. You will go over. Once Jesus Christ is the captain of your ship, 
you will go over. Trouble will come. Boisterous wave will come. Billow will roll. Turbulence will come. Because it comes with it. The Bible declares it. A man that is born of a woman. And but a few days to live. And full of trouble. So we were told that trouble will come. But Jesus, what Jesus has done for us, we are well able, we are well able to go over every storm, every tempest. I hear the writer said, one step of footprints on the sand. Oh God, when the writer thought he was by himself, oh glory to God. But during that time, Jesus was carrying him. Glory to God. Sometimes it seems as if he's nowhere, but he's carrying you. He is carrying you. He is carrying you. He's carrying you. He's carrying you. It's rough. Oh, hallelujah. At one point, Jesus said, Father, if it is possible, but God knew it was possible because he would have minister strength he knew that Jesus could carry it oh glory to God oh hallelujah and he sent angels to minister so it is we have the spirit of God in us oh sometimes when we are cast down the spirit of God minister ah God all of a sudden you, you hear a song oh hallelujah you don't know where the song comes from but there is a song oh hallelujah and you find yourself start singing ah God and when you listen to the song it is an assurance that God is saying to you daughter what you are going through you are able to carry you through Oh, glory to God. All of a sudden, you start to muster up strength. You don't know where the strength comes from. Oh, glory to God. But your hope is built on nothing less than Jesus' blood and his righteousness. Oh, God, our hope is built on his firm foundation. Everything else around us is sinking sand. But Jesus Christ is a firm firm foundation if you build on him you abide it forever glory to god yes trouble will come and trouble is our manure yes trouble amen help us to grow yes sometimes we get relaxed and think everything is going on fine but sometimes we meet upon a little patch hallelujah amen like when you travel in a car and you get into a pothole ah ha 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 yes sometimes you meet up on a little bump but hold on man he will see you through glory to God no matter what the situation God will see you through glory to God God, Jesus Christ gave his life oh hallelujah for us he paid that price for us he went up to Golgotha for us he was near for us hallelujah hallelujah he wear a crown of thorn for us but he did not give up oh praise God he bore it all and today we have Oh, praise God, access to the throne of grace. We can cry, Abba, Father. We can ask God to forgive us. And we are for forgiven. Glory to God. What a wonderful Savior. A wonderful Savior is Jesus, my Lord. A wonderful Savior to me. He hideth my soul in the cleft of the rock. Where rivers of pleasure I see. He hideth my soul. Oh, hallelujah. In the depth of his love. And he covers me there with his hand. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. He covers us there with his hand. He said, nobody can take you out of my hand. No one. I gave my life for you. I bore the cross for you. I came to rescue you. Rescue the perishing. Cares for the dying. Oh, hallelujah. 
Oh, hallelujah. 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 And the writer said today, Oh, hallelujah. I can take a heart that's broken. Make it over again. But I know a man who can. And I can take a soul that's in sick. Make it whiter than snow. But I know a man who can. And some call him Savior, the Redeemer of men. But I call him Jesus. For he is my dearest friend. And when you think no one can help you, oh, and your life is all ahead. Hallelujah. But I know a man. can help you. And your life is out of hand. Remember today, I know a man who can sing along with me, brethren. If you know it, hallelujah. Some call him Savior, the Redeemer of man. For he's our dearest friend. He's my dearest friend. And when you think, and when you think, no one can help you, and your life is out of hand. Without a pen, I know a man. I know a man. Hallelujah. Who can let me reassure you again? Hallelujah. Some call him Savior. We call him Savior. the Redeemer of men. But I call him Jesus, for he's our dearest friend. He's my dearest friend. And when you feel no one can help you, your life is out of hand. Yes, there's a man. I know a man who can. Somebody's getting it today. Oh, some call him Savior, the Redeemer, Redeemer of me. For he is our dearest friend. And when you feel no one can help you, and your life is out of hand, I know a man who can. When
when you feel as if no one can help you and your life you feel that way and your life is out of hand yes there is a man there is a man there is a man there is someone who can he was wounded for your transgression he was bruised for your iniquity the chastisement of our peace was upon him and with his stripes we are healed we are no longer a slave to fear but we are the children of the most high God you are no longer in bondage in the cross be our glory ever till our rapture so shall find rest beyond the river look to the cross in him you find peace in him you find joy in him you find happiness all you need today is in that cross be my glory ever God bless you in Jesus name praise the Lord praise the Lord come on and praise the Lord Come on and put your hands together for our Evangelist Williams. Come on and put your hands together for our Evangelist Williams this morning. Praise the name of the Lord. Just stretch your hand towards her as they're praying for her. Say, bless her, Lord. Say, bless her, Lord. Say, give her more, Lord. Pour into her more, Lord. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Evangelist Williams, for ministering this morning allowing God to use you to bring forth his word amen God's rescue plan God's rescue plan just look at your neighbor and said he rescued me <laughs> I said look at your neighbor and say he rescued me uh, some of y'all wasn't rescued but I know that he rescued me. I know that he rescued me. I know that he took me out of something and brought me a mighty long way. I know that I was a wretch in sin and undone. And he picked me up and he turned me around and he dusted me off. You see, some of y'all been perfect all your life. You see, some of y'all been good in two shoes all your life. But he rescued me because I was sinking deep in sin, far from the peaceful shore. Sinking, 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 sinking to rise no more. But the captain, the captain of my life, the captain of this world, heard my cry like he heard the woman at the well. Like he heard the man begging for arms, and he rescued me. Come on, stand to your feet this morning. Come on and stand to your feet this morning. We're about to go. Maybe we should open the doors, because maybe there's someone that's out there that needs to hear this, that needs to be rescued. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. One interesting thing I heard our evangelist William say was that Jesus said, I did not come to be ministered to, but I came to minister to someone. When you gonna show up to minister to someone? When you gonna start showing up to minister to someone? Don't you know that in ministering to someone, that God is going to give you what you need. But we always show up to be ministered to. We always showed up to be poured into. But we never want to pour in to anybody. Jesus. Jesus. You know what I like about the text? It said that they try to tell Pilate, you can't have him named as king of the Jews. You got to change that. Make it say that he said 
that he's the king of the Jews. But Pilate, this is what we like to say now, I said what I said and I meant it. But Pilate back then, he said, I said what I said and I'm not changing it. And the enemy, the devil, and some people would like to change the name that God has already ascribed to you in the spirit, but the Holy Ghost is saying, I said what I said about you and I'm not changing it. So regardless of how people want to change your name, I've written your name down in glory and they can say what they want to say, but I said what I said and I meant it. I said that he's a worshiper. I said that she's on fire. I said that they are the head and not the tail. I said that they're coming out. And when I said what I said, I meant it. So I don't care what demon in hell is trying to change it. God is saying, I said what I said about you and I meant it. Why don't you believe it? I meant what I said about you. I said that you are the leader. I said that you're not the tail. I said that you're coming out. And we're going to have an outer call this morning. And those that need prayer can come. And those that are on Zoom and YouTube and Facebook, whatever the need, God can meet. Whatever the need is, God can hear and God can carry out. And for those of you that may not need the prayer, we're going to stretch you a little this morning. I want you to get somebody in your mind. Get somebody in your thought. Get somebody in your heart. And come to this altar, even if it's not for you. Because this morning, you are going to tarry. This morning, you are going to cry out. This morning, you are going to go forth. But not for yourself, but for somebody else. Amen? Amen? I know our sister Camille is asking for prayer for her nephew and friend. And she's going to come forth. And sister Camille, you're going to pray as well. As we're all going to pray. But everybody should be here with a person in mind. Everybody should be here with a family member or a friend or an acquaintance or an associate in mind. And this morning, we're going to tap the heavens on their behalf because we didn't come just to be ministered to, but we came to minister to someone else. But we came to hear the voice just like Jesus said, I must go through there because there's a voice that's crying out. There's a voice that's begging out and the voice that was crying out. My God, she said, give me what you got to give me because the life I've been living, I don't want to live no more. I don't want to come here no more. I don't want to be on drugs anymore. I don't want to be a prostitute anymore. I don't want to be a drug dealer anymore. But it's the only way I know. But if you got something that's better, give it to me. And I won't come here anymore. I won't dwell there anymore. I won't look there anymore. There's somebody in your life that needs you to pray so that they don't have to do what they're doing anymore. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. So we're going to pray this morning. And we're going to have a person in our mind and our hearts. And in praying for them and interceding on their behalf, God is going to work things out on our behalf. God is going to do things on our behalf. Praise the name of the Lord. Father, we are going forth in prayer for whoever we have in our minds and our hearts. Father, we thank you this morning. Father God, we thank you that we were able to catch the principle, Father God, that we are not only here to be ministered to, my God, but there is times, Lord, Father God, that we must minister to someone else, Lord. So I pray, my God, you would give souls on our hearts, my God. I pray, Lord, Father God, that you would give us the burden of sinners, my God. Give us the burden of souls, my God. Lord, Father God, begin to help us to hear those that are crying out. Begin to help us, my God, to hear those that are aching, my God. Begin to help us, Father God, to be sensitive to those that want to change, my God.
to those that are looking to flee their current lifestyle, my God, to those that are looking to abort, my God, the mission that they're on now, Lord, Father God, but they don't know what to turn to. That's their only source, my God. But I pray right now, Father God, that you will replace that source, my God, because in you we would have life, Lord, Father God, and not just life, but have it more abundantly, my God. So there is something sweeter awaiting. There is something greater awaiting. There is something powerful awaiting. There is something anointing awaiting. So my God, I pray even now, Father God, for every person that is here, my God, for everyone that is on their hearts, my God, for everyone that is on their mind, my God, whether it be family member, associate, my God, whatever it is, co-worker, my God, I pray that even now, Father God, you would reach out, my God, touch their hearts, my God, meet them where they're at, my God, meet them at their well, Father God, meet them at their place, Lord, Father God, that they need an increase. Meet them at their place, my God, where you can turn them around, Lord, to be your evangelist, to be your missionary, to be your prophet, to be your speaker, to be your praise and worship leader, to be your saint, my God. Draw them, my God. Draw them, my God. For the devil has drawn them for too long. But my God, this morning, we pray, my God, that your spirit, I got a mercy. That your spirit, I got na 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 mercy. That the God that is within us, my God, will draw them, my God, will pull them, my God, will grab them, my God, from where they're at, my God, wherever it may be, my God, drag them, my God, pull them, Lord, Father God, into your marvelous light, Father. Help them to know you, Lord. And I pray for Sister Camille, Father. And she's asking for prayer for her nephew and for a friend, my God. Lord, Father God, hit them right now. My God, do a work in them right now. Lord, Father God, take away sleep if you have to, my God. Lord, Father God, trouble their lives if you have to, my God. Until they will know that the only peace they will get is when they yield unto you, my God. So I pray that even right now, Lord, Father God, you would stir up things in their life, my God, until they would cry out, until they would seek unto you, my God, and that you would bring that peace into their life, Father God. We pray even this morning, my God, that, Lord, Father God, we are pouring into someone else, my God, just as you've come to minister to us, Father, and we are disciples of you, Father God. That is not about us, Lord but we are going to minister to someone else. And Father, as you ministered and went through doing good, my God, Lord, God gave you the keys to everything. He rose you up with all power so that when we minister to someone else, Lord, Father God, you're increasing us, my God. You're giving us more power. You're doubling our anointing. My God, you're doubling our seek, my God. You're doubling our prayer life, my God. You are doubling our discernment, my God. And we thank you even now, Father. We thank you even now, Lord. We thank you even now. We thank you even now. We pray, my God, that the spirit that resides in us, that is your spirit, my God, will draw, Father. That it would draw, Lord. Sister Renee, you move into an influencer in your group. I think you've been influenced a lot in the past with some people that you connected with. But God is making you into an influencer for those same people. And they're watching and they're looking. So you continue to do whatever it is that God will have that God will have you to do. And they're gonna test you. Little simple things. But you continue to do what God will have you to do. Because God is changing your influence with some of those people and some of those circles where you were more influenced by them before, but now you are turning into an influencer where you're influencing them even more. You be the God that they need in their life. You show them the light of God in their life. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. 
Have faith believing that Jesus and God is able to do whatever it is that he said you would do. Expediently, abundantly, and above all things that you could ever ask for, God is going to do it. God is going to do it. Some things we don't have to worry about. Some things we don't have to worry about. It's, it's beyond us, but God has a plan. Just leave it in his hands. In Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Everybody can return to their seats. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. We thank you for joining us, for those that are here live and those that are on Facebook Live and on Zoom and on YouTube and whatever platform you happen to see the service. Thank you for joining us this morning. We pray that there was a blessing, not just a blessing, but that something in your life was changed and that you would come again to hear the word of the Lord and to worship with us. And if you're ever in the neighborhood or know someone in the neighborhood, we're located at 998 Rutland Road in Brooklyn, New York. Come on by and have a great time in the Lord. We thank you and we bless you. Amen. And we're going to just stand and give a benediction. Now Pastor Brent is coming with us for some notices. I know uh, our Pastor Mackey let us like to do the decree, so I'm going to keep in that fashion. So everybody raising their hand. I decree that I am whatever God said about me. He said what he said, and that's it. Praise the name of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. God bless you, sir. Hallelujah. That's it.